Welcome to EliteGuitarist.com. My name is Christina Sonsengen and today I'm gonna teach you how to play Moments in Solitude. Moments in Solitude is written by Ole Bull, which is a uh, a um, Norwegian violin player and a composer from the Romantic period. And uh, I love this piece because it's so melancholic and so beautiful and calm. So it starts with um, some kind of an intro and I'm gonna uh, go through that first. And it says, in the score it says, uh, MP, mezzo piano. So that means that we can play it a little bit soft to start with. The first chord is uh, E, G, B, and E. And then F, G, B. That's played on fourth string. 3rd and 2nd. Uh, so what I do with the, my right hand is that I simply after the 1st chord, which is the normal position with the um, E, M, A on these 3, 3rd, uh, 2nd and 1st. After that I jump with these 3 up one. Uh, one string up basically for for all the fingers and then the next chord which i play now is a on the fifth string c on the third string and e on the second string and i hold the c and the e with my second finger and my third finger and the bass string a when i play that i make sure to mute the previous e that we had so when i play the chord um, we have now played and now i play the next the chord with the a with the a bass i simply take my thumb up to the E again to mute it. I'm gonna play again from the beginning and then a little bit uh, further. We jump up to the seventh fret and put a bar chord. So that's then you have B in the bar chord with your first finger on the sixth string, and you have the the D sharp on the third string on the eighth fret with your second finger, and then the G on the second string with your third finger in the eighth fret. And then the next note is A, which you have here in the bar, bar chord. Um, you play it with the I finger. And then you have everything ready with the D sharp and G. And then you lift the third finger and have that chord. So the melody line here goes uh, from the G to the F sharp. Make sure that the G is a bit uh, stronger than the F sharp. And then after that, the piece kind of starts. I'm gonna play through the intro part one more time. And then we go further with the harmonic 
on the second string uh, in the 12th fret. I like to play it with my uh, fourth finger. That's the start of the piece and start of the melody. Okay, play the intro. Thank you. 